I am officially 24, which is so not exciting. Is it exciting? <laughs> All I know is that I'm one more year closer to my mid-20s. Let's not dwell on that for too long. I'm going to be doing a bit more of a no sodium, well, trying to do a bit of a no sodium week. I've been feeling, because I've actually been feeling so face bloated. And so this week, I just want to kind of strip it back a little bit. So we're going to be eating a little bit simpler this week. So if that's not the kind of video you wanted to watch, I'm super sorry. Might as well tell you now so I'm not wasting your time. <laughs> Anyways, breakfast. This is some tahini and Dijon mustard sauce that I made yesterday, but it's thickened quite a bit, so I'm just going to add some water to it to liquefy a little bit. I'm also going to add some tomatoes. These are actually from my grandma's garden, and she knows I love salads. Well, I've been off them a little bit, but I'm trying to get back into it. So she's picked me a whole bunch of little cherry tomatoes from her garden. Look how small they are. And I'm going to add some avocado too. Lunch is served. Let's try some of my grandma's. Good morning. Since it's nearly lunchtime, I'm just going to have a coffee and a banana. Yeah, I was going to go for a walk. Maybe not. It's still sunny, so maybe I'll go for one later. Um, in terms of lecture content, stress rate, we are possibly increasing by the minute because I realize that I understand the material, but I'm yet to actually memorize it. We're increasing by the second. So yeah, so I'm going to eat my breakfast and um, I'll see you at lunchtime. Mum has also made some soup. Got carrots, melon, corn, and of course, pork. Okay, 
So as you can see, this dotted line here, both people low and high on attachment avoidance were quite low. And so basically what that means is that even on days of high stress, <laughs> Good morning everyone! It is Friday today and this morning we're going on an exciting adventure to the city. I've been invited to a little high tea. It's very fancy. So I'm going with my mum today um, where I'm about to eat something that I didn't cook myself. <laughs> And this is what my outfit looks like. I've never worn these pants before. They're very... <gasps> what is that? Oh, so guys, I might have to change. <laughs> I was going to say I've never worn these pants before, but I guess that tradition is going to continue because your girl can't wear this with this awkward stain right there. Anyways, yeah, I'll see you at the high tea. We've got our little seat here and here is our little high tea set. So we've got our teas and we're going to start eating now. He gave us a description of what everything was, but honestly, I can't remember. They usually have it in like a freeze dried, freeze, freeze dried ice. Freeze dried? Freeze dried ice. The shipment didn't come today, so we're gonna have it without the ice. Mm. This one is not too sweet. I just blew on it. Is it good? Yeah. Crispy? Mm. I feel like I shouldn't have asked her how it was while she was like, while oh, you were mid bite. <laughs> Before we go downstairs, I want to show you something that my mum got me. She got me this little key ring. So this one's hers because her favourite is the lemon tea. She knows I love soy milk. So she got me this one. I won't open hers because I'll leave her to open it. But this is mine. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh my gosh, look at that mountain. Look at that mountain of lolly slides. Oh, blueberry jelly layered cake. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I can't be bothered. I got sweet and chili chicken. Mine also had a piece of hair in it, so. Not man, mine was never fun. Who's winning? Oh, you look so good. 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 Monica, Phoebe, oh, what's her name? Jennifer Aniston. Oh, is that what it looks like? Yeah, and then I forgot, who is this guy? Oh, get your cafe, go, go. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, it's the guy that had a... Yeah, don't you, Rachel? Go. Friend... Oh, Rachel. It's okay. so cool. Look at the box. <laughs> Good morning everyone, it is Monday today and I've just been to the gym and as you can tell I've clearly showered <laughs> but we've no time to dry my hair because it is already 12 like it is smack bang on 12 and today I have so much uni work to do because I have to catch up on last week's lectures but I also want to go collect my ceramics from the clay center because it's finally ready to be picked up and I have a free Starbucks for, from my birthday which expires today. So that is basically the plan. We're gonna do those things because I'm not gonna pass up on a free Starbucks. <laughs> However, I am gonna prep my lunch though. I've got some zucchini, eggs, veggies, and other things, and I'm gonna put some avocado. My mum bought this entire bag of avocados for me, $2. This entire bag of avocados was $2. There is one, two, three, seven avocados. It's the little things in life that really get to you. <laughs> and also how cute is this little tub of Sriracha. Uh, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna meal prep. So exciting. Okay, let's go. I think it's in here. Good, how are you? Yeah. Top. Oh, thank you. Sorry. Oh, no, that's fine. I'm still trying to figure out which one is. <laughs>
So I've just finished dinner and I'm about to make this steam tofu dish for my parents. I was also going to make like the stir fry udon but we actually have some leftovers so I'm going <laughs> to, I actually have already cooked the noodles but they can just have noodles. And I'm going to make this dish that's an easy tofu recipe. I don't know if you can see it. And I managed to actually find spam and spring onion so it is perfect. Um, anyways, yeah. They're coming home now, so I'm going to start making this. So, there is a real danger that bilingual children can be misdiagnosed as having a language disorder simply because they're using these kind of therapists or teachers discount it and think, oh, it's just a second language. And it's got some differences phonologically, grammatically, and lexically from this as children who actually have viva. Good morning, everyone. Ooh. It is a Thursday today and I am about to head out. It is currently around 11-ish. I've been doing tutorials and some other like assignment work all day. And you know what? I've just been feeling a little bit boggy in the past few days. Yeah, gluggish. I don't know. So I thought even though I'm trying to save for something super special coming up, I thought I'd treat myself this today just go outside i'm thinking about going to a brunch a little brunch place i literally every day if i'm not studying or i'm in a or if i'm in a lecture and i get distracted i'm looking at cafes to go to because i don't know i just feel like since lockdown a lot of a lot of cafes around here have just not been demand so yeah i like try to really find cafes i like and know that if i'm investing money in it that I'm going to like the meal. And I really have been craving some soba noodles. So we're going to go back to Newbie Cafe in Newmarket. And we're going to have a little adventure. So yeah, that's what's happening today. Do you like this dress? I haven't worn it in a very long time. It's a bit of an office dress. Can you... <laughs> kind of looks like this. I love it because even if I eat a lot, you can't see it. Anyways, we're going to go. We have made it. It's a lot busier than I was expecting, actually. Or well, they could just be going to the gym, because this mall has a gym, so. They're probably just going to work out, whilst my only adventure, my only aim today, is to eat. <laughs> Just finished my lunch. 
the soba noodles are really good. Anyways, um, it's currently three o'clock. I've done a bit of uni work and I'm just gonna have a look around, have a little shop because the weather is so nice and it's not gonna last like this forever. So I'm gonna, I actually have a lecture on right now. I'll just watch it later and enjoy some me time. Is it just yet la? Where is it? Oh my god. Don't smile. It's tiny. <laughs> oh, I was expecting like a fully grown strawberry. Mm. Tiny. 